the Kool-Aid challenge has come to Krantz in a dopey social media dare inspired by a cute ad meant to sell a sugary drink, not damaged property. Hello again, everybody. I'm Gene Valicenti. And I'm Emily Foles. Police say at least two fences were damaged, possibly by kids trying to recreate a classic commercial. NBC 10's Katie Benoit explains it's not the first time this has happened in our area. A costly prank near the Cranston Johnston line. Giant holes punched into privacy fences. You can see right through to the pool at this home on Birchwood Drive. A few streets over, the gaps are smaller, but still noticeable. It's a little upsetting. One homeowner who declined to speak with us on camera says he was a victim of the Kool-Aid Man challenge. Videos often appearing on TikTok encourage teens to run through a fence. Like the soft drink mascot did in advertisements. Neighbors not thrilled about kids recreating the old commercials. I think it's terrible that, you know, kids are defacing property and stuff like that. I, you know, hopefully they get caught. Somebody catches them on a ring doorbell and reports it. Residents told us a similar situation happened in the area near Plainfield Pike months ago. NBC10 also spoke with the Raynham woman who became a victim of the challenge last fall. I think we were pretty shocked at how easily the fence exploded. Back in Cranston, there's still repair work to be done. Could be frustrating for a homeowner and expensive. Police say so far, there are no suspects in the two cases of vandalism. In Cranston, Katie Bedoint, NBC 10 News.